You know, during this offseason, everyone was talking about the same thing, Casa, and that is how are we going to get a running game going? And then the Chargers pull one in the sixth round as they draft the fullback out of Wisconsin. He used to clear the way for Melvin Gordon, Derek Watt, and Derek is joining us right now. First of all, Derek, thanks for coming on by. Thank you for having me. All right, Derek. Uh, when we heard that you had been drafted, two things we thought. One, it's great to have a true fullback again because that's been missing in this offense for the last couple of years. And then obviously the intrigue of you clearing holes for Melvin Gordon back in your days in Wisconsin. Let's talk about Gordon because here's a guy that obviously two years ago, runner up for the Heisman Trophy, just dominated the college scene. But he struggled last year as a rookie with the Chargers. Rejoining him this year, have you seen any difference in Melvin? Does he look like the same guy to you? Um, yeah, definitely. You know, it's it's uh, it takes all 11 guys. You know, it's not just Melvin. Um, you know, he he had a tough year, but um, you know he works harder than anybody. You know, I know I know he's um, you know been working and having a great off season and and looking great so far in camp. And, and we were just talking the other day during practice, and you know we're we're getting back into our groove. You know, we're, we're, our our steps are on, on point together and. Um, you know, he's getting comfortable again, and, and you know, he's, been, he's been looking really good so far in camp, and, and we're feeling comfortable. Not to give away the game plan, but do you get a sense that you're going to be an integral part, uh, especially, you know, preseason game coming, coming up, uh, with number one coming up here on, uh, on Saturday, that you're going to have a, a say-so in it? Uh, you know, definitely. I'd like to, you know, we're trying to run the ball and, and establish the run, um, and, you know, getting in two backs in the backfield is kind of part of that, and, and um, you know, it's not up to me whether, you know, how much of, an, uh, how, much of uh, you know, how many reps I get, but um, I'm going to make my reps count and try to make the most of them and, uh, you know, help get the running game going. We were talking about the Hall of Fame and that next year, one of the greatest Chargers of all time, certainly the greatest running back in Charger history, LaDainian Tomlinson, he's going to be a first ballot Hall of Famer, but he'll be first to tell you I would never have gotten there without Lorenzo Neal, who's the premier fullback of his era. Talk about how you guys ran your offense at, at Wisconsin with Melvin and, and how that worked, that dynamic between you and him. Yeah, um, you know, definitely. It, it's really similar. When you get in the two-back system, um, again, it takes all 11 guys. It's not, you know, me and Melvin. It's not, um, you know, just Melvin. It's, it's literally every guy doing their job. Um, but we, you know, we were just tough, hard-nosed guys, and, and we wanted to establish the run and impose our will. Um, and that's kind of, you know, our thing. And, and really all you have to do with, with Melvin back there and, and you just got to do your job. Cover your guy up, uh, and, and he'll, he's, he does some special things back there, and, and all of our running backs do, really. Um, just, just do your job. Don't worry about everything else, and, and they'll make some special things happen. Your first week and a half in training camp as a professional running back slash fullback in the NFL, how's it gone? Oh, it's going good. Um, you know, feeling more comfortable each day, um, you know, installing a little bit more as well. Um, but like I said, you know, we're getting in our groove kind of now, and, and just, you know, it's, it's, it's good. It's, we're grinding out here now on pads. Um, you know, every day, really. So it's, it's uh, you know, it's, it's kind of what the life of a fullback is. Firing out on a 20-year-old sophomore in college and then coming out here and having to block a guy like Melvin Ingram. How's that been? Um, you know, Melvin's a great player. Uh, it's, you know, it's good work for me. It's a good challenge. Um, you know, our defense has, they, they throw a lot at us, and we got some good guys on that defense. And um, it's a good challenge for me each and every day and, uh, you know, opportunities to get better.